Lainey and Wyatt, thank you for inviting all of us to be part of this special day. There are many important experiences that have led to this day, and there will be many more important moments after. But today is one moment in time shared with the people who love you the most. Bye. <laughs> Hi, sweetie. <laughs> Yeah, I know. I know. I forgot sunscreen. <laughs> Did you? Yeah, I need it's you need my arms. You probably need you look something. Very nice, In and amidst all of your wedded bliss, there may come from time to time moments when one of you isn't feeling your best. And in that moment, when one of you is not operating at 100% and feeling less than, the other can make up the difference. At a fork in the road, follow each other. Remember, it's not you versus me, it's us versus the world. Remember. I don't just mean remember this day or remember the significance of each moment you'll share. I mean, remember why each of you is the one. I love you so much, sweetheart. You have become the best part of my life. You have brought out the best parts of me in our two years together, sweetie. The part I love most about you is you are the most genuine person I have ever met in my life, and the love you spread around you is unmatched. I love our relationship because we let each other be ourselves, which is the best version of both of us, and having our son has shown me more of your true, loving nature, which is one of the things I love most about you. You show love and compassion to strangers, and you also show even more love to the people around you. You have become the best mother and wife that Hudson and I could have asked for. I can't wait for the beautiful memories that the three of us are going to have forever. I love you, Lainey. <laughs> wow, you did better than me. <laughs> I vow to watch UFC with you whenever you want to watch it. I vow to always laugh at your jokes, even if they aren't my type of funny. I vow to be more compromising in life. I vow to raise our beautiful boy together with you always. God damn. Um, I vow to always be someone who you can talk to about anything without judgment. And I vowed to always put you and Hudson first in my life before anything else. And I vow to love you for everything you are and will be. <laughs> I love you too. I, I should learn. I need tissues. You're fine. You look just fine. Now that Wyatt and Lainey have made their lifelong promises to each other, they've chosen to symbolize the joining of their lives by participating in a very special ceremony. Let's bring out the whiskey. <laughs> um, you guys can turn around. Yeah? Hi. I know, I always cry. Now, some of you may not know this, but a good whiskey is like a good marriage in a lot of ways. It warms you from the inside. It can boost your courage when it may be lacking, and it can help you face difficult situations with a little bit of ease. Cheers to your wedding day and a lifelong partnership. <laughs> Wyatt and Lainey, in the presence of your family and friends, a little bit of Pendleton, you have joined yourselves in marriage with your solemn vows, the joining of hands, and the giving and receiving of rings. By the power vested in me, I now pronounce that you are husband and wife. Wyatt, you may kiss your bride. Family and friends, it is my honor to introduce to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Borgen. I'm 
Blaney's best friend. I've seen my friend um, go from the very first time we met each other to toxic relationships to being um, single to her dating around but never finding anyone good enough until you came along, Wyatt. You changed the way she receives love and respect and now being able to see everything come full circle to the night you proposed to even asking me to take the pictures. Um, that's something I'll never forget. Why has always had a way of making everyone around him feel valued and loved. His kindness, his sense of humor, his unwavering loyalty are just a few of the qualities that make him such an incredible friend and a partner to you, Laney. Laney, you are truly lucky to have found someone as wonderful as Wyatt. I'm sorry you have to deal with Wyatt. <laughs> as we raise our glasses, let's toast to Wyatt and Laney. May your lives together be filled with endless love, laughter, and adventure. Here's to a lifetime of happiness and cherished memories. Congratulations to the newlyweds. Just